The fifth tool in this list of seven tools is scatter plot. Scatter plot is basically a plot between two variables. One variable is dependent and the second one is independent. Let's take an example of ice cream sale. The shopkeeper who is selling ice cream wants to know whether the sale of ice cream depends on the temperature or not. So what this fellow will do is this fellow will plot a scatter plot, the temperature on x axis and number of ice cream sold on the y axis. With that, this fellow will take a daily reading for every day what was the maximum temperature and what was the number of ice cream sold and if this person plots a scatter plot between the outside temperature and the sale then that will give a good indication whether there is any relationship between the temperature and the sale of the ice cream that's a simple example conventionally in scatter plot on x axis we keep independent variable independent variable or let's call this as input variable whatever is the input and on y axis we put the dependent variable or the output so in case of ice cream sale the temperature was an independent variable so temperature is plotted on the x axis and sale was a dependent variable sale is a dependent variable because sale is depending on temperature that's what we want to prove so sale goes on the y axis and this shows whether there is any relationship whether with the rise of temperature ice cream sale goes up or down or if there is no change you can just look at the scatter plot and that can give you a good idea of the relationship between these two variables. Let us take another example on the next slide and that example will be related to me reaching my office at 6.30 am. We have talked earlier also about that example. Let us plot a scatter plot for that. 